Okay, folks, so we're gonna do an install video on some changes we're gonna be doing with, with Jade Shadow, uh, the Road King, and uh, wanted to bring you along. So here we go. So here's what we got going on. We're gonna be changing up some of the lighting and the windshield. I am really getting tired of people coming and saying, hey, nice street glide. This is not a street glide. Um, so we're gonna try something a little different. I'm gonna replace the bat wing fairing with a windshield, a really cool windshield. And we're gonna do some work on the lighting. So right now, I'm going to take that guy off and then we're going to change some bulbs. And my assistants for today are Sirsha, say hi. hi. And Stefan. Okay, let's get this done. I see you. I see you. You can watch out, bud. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna loosen these guys up just a little bit. Right there. And at the top on the other side. And then we're going to remove the clips and take the fairing off. Sides up and then straight up. There we go. Then we're going to tighten these guys back down just for good measure. And then the new windshield is going to go on this area here. It's going to clip right into there and down here, whoop, down here where the Memphis Shades was already on. So it'll go right into those rubber grommets on both sides. Now we got to do something about these guys. Now I left these guys on on purpose because I thought there was always a possibility that I would be running the bike without the fairing. Um, so now we need to get rid of these incandescent puppies here. And back here. So let's do that now. Okay, guys. Put that on the chair over there. Grandpa's chair. Okay, guys. So we got this package in here from Hogwarts. Let's see what these look like now there's a bunch a bunch of different lights out there there's custom dynamics there's harley branded custom dynamics there's a bunch of stuff i like what the hogwarts does so that is what i ordered to put on the bike 
These come with the smoke lenses, so I have an extra set of those. These are going to be the rears, and these are going to be the front. So let's do the front first. We're going to open this up. And we get the little black card, and then we get these guys. So they're pretty simple to put on. First thing that we need to do... You can hold that. Okay, let me have the lights back, guys. Perfect. So what we're going to do first is we're going to take off the um, current smoked lenses and remove the light bulbs. So there's going to be a tab... There's going to be a tab on here, and I normally stick those at the bottom, so you just got to feel for it. Oh, it's right here on the side. See that there? And we're going to put the knife into it. Am I showing you? Ah, there we go. We're going to put the knife right there into it, and then we're just going to pop that off. Like so. And then you're going to reach in there, and you're going to take this out just by twisting it and pulling it straight out. Now that we have that out... You're going to notice here that there's two little posts right there and down on the bottom that stick out to the side. One's down deep inside and one's, oh, about a quarter of an inch up right there. So we're going to look in here and there's the channel right there where my finger is that goes for the deep one. So I'm going to find that, I'm going to push it in there. I'm just going to turn this. Okay, so that's what it will look like. Let's do the other side. Over there. Okay, guys, now we got both of those hanging. Now, being the paranoid person I am, I'm going to just turn them on real quick, make sure that they're connected right. And there we go. Okay, guys, a quick voiceover. These are not installed correctly. They're not supposed to behave that way. I contacted Hogwarts and they told me just to take them out, rotate it, and put it back in. Uh, rotate it about 180 degrees so the posts go in the opposite channels and that fixes the problem. Kudos to Hogwarts for the quick response that helped me with this. Okay guys, this is the result of the install. You'll see I still kept those lights right down there. These are the new ones. And the reason I chose the Hogwarts, I was going to tell you how it works, is because it does this. I really like that strobe effect. In the back, here's what we got. And of course, taking off the blinker, we have this to provide a lot of extra light and this. Now let's move on to the windshield. Okay guys, now it's time to install the windshield. Let's open this up.
very well packaged. Let's get this onto the bike. Just like earlier, first thing we're gonna do is go ahead and loosen these bolts. Which will tighten back down after we have the windshield on. Make sure that you're seated down in there properly. Loosen this side up just a little bit more. <laughs> Raise it over the headlight of just a tad and push it on fully. There we go. Now that that's on, we're going to tighten these down. Once more. Let's go ahead and take a look at the lights again and the windshield. There you go. What do you think? See how it curls back, follows the line of the handlebars back, and then right here we have the little vent to open up to get a little bit better airflow and you can set it at any angle or close it straight on up so here's the view right here you'll see that you get a lot more exposure to the elements better view more one with the road i'm going to give it a ride and see what it performs like see you in a few minutes okay we took her for a while a ride as you can see my beard's a little messy um did well uh no buffeting the vent worked well i'm excited uh, in two days we're going to take it out for a long ride with the harley group oops as my father-in-law laughs at me in the background uh we're going to take it out for a ride with the harley group on sunday in two days and i'll let you know how it goes have a good one, y'all. See you on the next video.